Hi, so this is just a quick tutorial on creating a 3D model on to, um, using a 2D image. So basically transferring an image into a model. So this is um, this could be very very useful in saving time etc. So what I've just done there is just create a, a plane so using the polygon primitive plane uh, just created a normal square. So what we're going to go on to is modify, convert, texture to geometry. Now this will bring up a little window. So what we want to do now is just select our image. So if you go into input image, select and obviously just select the picture that you want. So what I want is uh, this one. Just a picture of Batman. Click open and make sure that the plane itself is selected so it is. And I'm just going to leave all these um, settings to how they are. So if we go apply and close, now this will just create the image onto the plane, uh, plane itself. Hopefully it will be a little quicker. Okay, so now the image has loaded onto the texture. So as we can see, there's a lot of Pulling on, so if we don't just there we go, you can see the image slightly now because it is kind of uh, Batman's body is kind of occluded here. I think when we extrude it, the image actually will become a bit a bit distorted, a bit weird. So what we're going to do is window rendering editor hypershade because we want to get rid of all that white background so if we select this and I think this as well so these two right click and then select objects with material and if we just hit delete so this will just get rid of that um, white background itself so if we go into object mode and select the uh, model itself and then we go into edit mesh face extrude now this will just there we go it's easy you just hit one so that's extrude a bit so as we can see that the image has become a like a 3d 3d model um, maybe if we add a light we'll be able to see this a little better So create lights and we'll just create a point light. If we just there we go. So yeah, as you can see, it is 3D, when we put light on it, we can see that the model itself is actually 3D, so, so yeah, thank you for watching this tutorial, and uh, bye bye.